how to create payment gateway on Shopify, how to set up Shopify payments. Hi guys, welcome back to this channel and for today's video, I will show you the easy step-by-step -step on how you can set up your payment method here on your Shopify store. So without further ado, let's get into it. So first, you need to make sure that you already have your account and you have set up your Shopify store inside the Shopify.com website. So if you don't have it yet, then just go to Shopify.com, this website, and then just start your free trial here. And you can just create your account. And once you created your account, then create your own Shopify store. So for us to get started, let me just go ahead and log into my account to show you the step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can set up or add your payment method here in Shopify. All right, so I just log into my account. And as you can see here, guys, I have one here in Active Store. So this is the store that I created before. And when you created your store, you you will be provided free 14 days to make that store work online after 14 days that will be inactive and for that one to stay active you need to pick a plan which is a premium plan so i just created here a new online store or shopify store for this tutorial for me to show you how you can set up your online payment here in shopify so let me just go ahead and click to the store that i just created today all right, so I am now here in my store. So this is my uh, store admin access now. So here, as you can see, I don't have any product because this is a new store that I created just today because the old store that I used to is no longer active and I can no longer access that one without picking a premium plan. So here I will just go ahead and add a product. So by the way, guys, you have different option to add a product. If you have your own products or physical products, then you can manually add your product here. So just go to product tab and then here you can manually add your product. So you can upload your own image here. You can put the title, the description, the pricing, and the inventory available, your location, and everything. But if you like to make use of other uh, platform like AliExpress supplier, maybe, for example, then all you need to do is to go here, apps, and then here just look for the third-party app here that you can integrate inside your Shopify store. So for example, we have here the DSource AliExpress dropshipping and CJ dropshipping. These are the two recommended uh, dropshipping that you can make use of if you get your product from AliExpress because they are connected with AliExpress and you can easily import your uh, product from AliExpress to your Shopify using this two platform. So I will just go ahead and add some product from this, maybe using Deezers or CJ Dropshipping. And I will be back to you guys once the products has been added here in Shopify for us to add our own payment method. So here I just added the CJ dropshipping and I will go ahead and install this app for this one to be integrated inside my Shopify account. So let's just wait for a moment. So I am now here inside my CJ dropshipping. I already log in. And the next thing that you need to do here is to first, of course, connect your Shopify store. So just go to authorization and go to Shopify and start connecting your Shopify to your CJ dropshipping platform as well. So once you're done with that, then as you can see here, they have different categories for the product and all these products here are also from AliExpress. So what I love about this platform is that all the products here is that you can easily connect it to your Shopify store in just a few clicks. So there's no need for you to manually enter the product name, the description, uh, manually input the variation of the product because, because everything here you just need to do a few clicks and everything about the product from here can be transferred directly to your Shopify store automatically. So for example, here from all categories, you have different categories here to choose from. I will go ahead and choose the woman's clothing. And as you can see here, they also have a subcategories here for the woman's clothing. 
And over here, I can see the uh, women's clothing items. So here you have two options to connect. So to connect, if this product already exists in your store, so you just need to establish a product connection. But if this product is not yet in your Shopify store and this is new and you want this one to be added in your Shopify store, then you can just simply click this list. So once you click this list, then you will be routed to this page where you can manually set up everything here if what you want to be added and when you go to your Shopify store you can also see it here under your products that this product also been added here in your Shopify store so once you added all your product here then the next thing that we can do is to set up your payment method so to set up your payment method just go down here at the bottom of your left side corner, you can see your settings. So just click here and then here you have your payments. So just go to payment. So here under your payments, you have your payment providers, your supported payment method, and also you have your manual payment methods here if you like to add manual payment. So first for supported payment method, this is the payment methods that are available with one of Shopify approved payment providers. So the most common one or the most popular one is PayPal. So you can make use of PayPal as your payment method inside your Shopify store. So all you need to do is to complete your PayPal account setup to start receiving payout from your PayPal. So just click here and complete your account setup. You just need to log in to your PayPal account to start receiving payment through PayPal. And down here, you can also do manual payment methods. So payments that are made outside your online store, when a customer select a manual payment method such as cash on delivery, you'll need to approve their order before it can be fulfilled. So you can also add a cash on delivery payment method if you like to. But if you click add manual payment method, you also have different option here where you can create your custom payment method on your own bank deposit, money order, cash on delivery. So going up here, you also have your payment provider. So you can choose a payment provider here. So just click choose a provider and you will see the list of the third party payment providers here that you can make use of in your Shopify store. So for example, they have the two checkout provider, the Moleplay, Adyen, Airpay, Authorize.net, and many, many more. And there is no need for you to worry, guys, to set up this uh, payment because, for example, we will be selecting this provider, the two checkout, and here you will see uh, they will provide you the information about this provider. And down here, you can also see the instruction on how you can set up this one. So you just need to create a two checkout account, then log in and activate your two checkout account and other. So you have here the step by step instruction to follow and how you can add this provider to be your payment provider to process the payment. And also going down here, you can see what are the payment method that these providers support. So these providers support Visa, MasterCard, American Express, JCB, Discover, Dinner's Club. So these are the uh, payment method that this provider can support if you choose this provider. So it will depends on you guys. You have a long list here of provider that you can choose from. So you can also choose a payment method that are available with one of Shopify approved payment provider. So if you want to get a Shopify approved payment providers, then you just need to go here and then click this add payment methods. And here you just need to search if what kind of payment method you want to allow in your Shopify store. For example, you will allow a Visa and then you will also allow the MasterCard, the Express card. Going down here, you can see 17 providers offer this payment method. So these are the trusted payment provider of Shopify. So you can trust this provider. So you just need to click activate for you to start partnering with this payment providers. And also, if you like other online payment, then you can also search it here. For example, let's uh, search for Paymaya. So you will see here Paymaya and when you click Paymaya, you will also see three providers here that offers this kind of payment method, the Paymaya. And by the way, you can also 
accept payment using Bitcoin. So when you search for Bitcoin, you also have this one for cryptocurrency. And you will see that they have four providers here that offer this payment method, which is the BitPay, the Coinbase Commerce, Faster Pay, and Payment Wall. So I guess that's all for today's video. And I hope that you learned something today. And if you have any question, don't hesitate to comment down below. And thank you so much for your time watching this video.